Hi and welcome to another How to Play video by me, Stephen Charles. Um, I'm playing uh, this year's most open heartbake by Funeral Friend. Um, it's on their demo uh, EPs and they sound pretty, pretty good. So um, I think it's worth trying to learn them. Uh, hopefully the intonation on this guitar is back to as it should be after my recovery video. Um, so let's get started with the video. Okay, so for the intro, it's played about 81 beats per minute. I say about, but that's pretty much what it is. And um, yeah, so it starts off with one guitar feedbacking, and I'll call that guitar one for now. And for the rest of the song, I'll be calling that guitar guitar one. And for the uh, other guitar, I'll call that guitar two. So guitar one starts off feedbacking, and it happens to be the 14th fret on the high E string, so if you want you can play it and bring that in volume wise. Um, so after after uh, after a while the second guitar comes in with this riff here. So that's just one on the A, three on the D, three on the A, two on the D, side up to five on the D, um, three on the D, five on the D, two on the D. So. And when it when it gets to the end of that, you just go sustain it on that three when it's going into the faster verse. Okay, so when the other guitar stops feedbacking and comes in, the other guitar plays this. Which is 5, 7, 8, 5, 7, 7, 8, 5. So that's 5 on the A, 7 on the D, 8 on the A, 5 on the D, 7 on the A, 7 on the D, 8 on the D, 5 on the D. And that's exactly the same all the way through for the first three, apart from for the last one, when the last note is different, so it goes... So instead of going, it goes A7, instead of going A5. So hopefully that's uh, nice and simple. Um, compared to the rest of the song, it is quite simple. So, yeah, that's the intro. Okay, just for the verse, they, uh, both guitars play the same thing at first, and then they go into a harmony part. So I'll play the thing they play the same which is just a heavy riff, which is like that, okay? And that is played all on open, one and two. Um, and it starts off with one, and then on zero, so... Okay, so it's... Okay, so that's so one zero zero one and yeah, so one and one and so one zero 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 zero. Yes, yeah, so that's five notes. Okay, one zero one zero two zero zero zero. Zero zero two zero zero. Okay, so Okay, so then guitar one's harmony part is this. Okay, so that's three five on the A, seven on the D, eight on the A, five, seven on the D, seven, eight on the A, or instead of seven, eight on the A, you can play two, three on the D, up to you, whatever you find easier. So that'll be like... Okay, and the other harmony part for guitar two is open one on the A, three open on the D, and then two three on the D, and three five on the A. So... so Thank you. 
Okay, so that's the verse done. Hopefully you found that useful. Okay, so for the pre-chorus, um, there's only one guitar part, it's guitar one, and it plays this. Okay, so that's played eight, eight, and um, basically all the eights there are on the low E string, so eight, eight, ten, nine, ten, that's ten on the G, nine on the G, ten on the D, and then, and then eight, twelve, ten, is 12, 10, 9 on the G and 10 on the D, so and that's a lot of string skipping, so if you can't do it that fast then as always practice with a metronome, so okay, second section uh, is like this okay, so that's 3 twelves on the low E string, then 15 twelves 15, 14, 15, 12. So 15, 12 is on the A. 15, 14 on the D. 15, 12 back on the A. So. And then you move down two frets. 10 twice on the low E. And then play the octave on the D. And then back down to the low E. And then play 12, 10, 9, 10 on the G. 12, 10, 9. And then 10 on the D. So. So that's the first half of the pre-chorus. The second half of the pre-chorus has a slightly different uh, riff. It goes... Okay, so that's again with all those eights there, but instead of the... Uh, instead of... You're playing... Okay, so that's 10 on the, on the D, 10, 9 on the G, 10 on the D, 12, 10 on the G, 10 on the D. Okay? And then the second half of that uh, riff is the same as the first. And that's the pre-chorus. Okay, so for the chorus, we have um, both guitars back in, and the first guitar plays this. Okay, so that's two chords and then a small riff. So the first chord is 8, 8, 8, 10 um, on the lowest four strings. And then you move up to 10, 10, 10, 12 on the lowest four strings. Uh, it's essentially power chord and the octave on the fifth. So, um, so yeah. Uh, and then you have the riff, which is 10, 10, 9, 10, 12, 12, 12. And the 10, 10, 9 is on the G, and then 10, 12, 12, 12 on the D. So, so then you get guitar 2. Guitar 2, for the first chorus, plays this. Okay, and so that's at first the same chord that you're playing for the guitar 1 apart from without the low E string note so and you play it 6 times like that 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 and then move down to 5 and an octave chord 7 make sure you're not playing anything on the D string there so so here again you're playing the same chord that you're playing on the guitar one, without the low note. And you play an octave chord there on the three, third, third and fifth fret on the A and G respectively. And that's the first chorus, uh, second guitar. In the second chorus, um, the, uh, the chorus is twice as long, and so for the second half of that, uh, so for the extended bit, the guitar two plays something slightly different. It plays... Which is essentially 
Um, three octave chords, so and the eight, and then you add, then you just start barring the whole of the uh, eighth fret all the way along the guitar, apart from the lowest uh, note. So. And you can do that whilst leaving uh, the tenth fret on the G intact instead of uh, so you don't don't play eight on that G string. Play ten, so. Okay, and that's how you play uh, the whole chord. Okay, so the interlude is uh, quite short but difficult to play, and so I'm going to have just an entire section dedicated to it. Um, it's I'm um, going to play it once through proper speed and then once through slowly. Okay, so it should be like that. And it does that twice. So slower, that's. So to play that, you play open 12, 15, open 12, 15. So the first, uh, the open 12s are all on the E. And then the first 15 was on the A, and the second one was on the E, so, and then you play open 12, 10, 12, open 10, 8, 10, 10, 8, and that open 10 on the E, then 8 on the A, 10 back on the E, and then 7, 8, back on the A, so, Okay, and notice where I'm palm muting there. So you have palm mute, palm mute, not palm muting. 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 Palm mute, palm mute, not palm muting, not palm muting. Okay, so. Okay, so that's the interlude. Okay, so we're going to have a break. And uh, the, you know, the we will never be the same, um, that bit. And again, at this bit you have uh, both guitars back in, so for that interlude you had only one guitar. And I'll play the second guitar part first because it's nice and simple, it's just... Palm meter zeros um, all the way through. Okay, and the first guitar part is quite difficult, so the first guitar part is... Like that, okay? So at uh, full speed it's... Okay, so... Um, yeah, to play that, you play two palm muter zeros. Then you have three, two on the D string pulled off. So, and then palm muter zero on the low E. Three on the A. Palm mute zero, three, five on the A, palm mute zero, three, two, on the D, palm mute zero, five, two, three, five on the G, two, three, on the D. And every time I'm saying palm mute zero, I do mean on the low E string, so... That, for the first half. And the second half is palm mute zero, and then palm mute eight, and all those palm mute zero and palm mute eight will all be on the low E. So it's zero eight twelve on the D, zero eight twelve on the A, zero eight twelve on the D, zero eight nine on the G, zero eight nine nine ten on the G. So okay, so. That's how you play the bridge, and you play that through four times. Okay, so uh, after that you play the pre-chorus again, chorus, and then the outro is the start of the verse. And that's the ending. Hope you found this uh, video useful. As always, open to criticism and any suggestions on how I can make these videos better. Um, I'm planning on like kind of just making as many as I possibly can at the moment, and then if I get enough um, response in terms of how what I can improve, I'll remake them and hopefully they'll be better. Um, yeah, so thanks for watching. This has been me playing This Year's My Seven Heartbreak by Funeral for a Friend.
before I cut this off. Um, if you do find it difficult to play, play it at half speed because uh, it does get tricky to play at first. So use a metronome. It's something I didn't do when I started off playing guitar, but I really do advise it because it's so useful.